Hello, good morning, and welcome to another episode of Assassin's Creed Origins. And um, in the episode that I did from yesterday, we had arrived at the Saqqara Nome, um, specifically the pyramids of Dashur, um, the Bent Pyramid of Snefru, um, the Pyramid of Djosa, and um, Hey, say so, so. Yes, we've arrived at some pyramids. But what about the pyramids of the most sacred Giza? Well, how about we have a look at the pyramids of the most sacred Giza today? So let's have a look. So the hyena. Um, right now, there's an incoming threat. I remember from. Siwa. So shall we quickly do that before we go um, <coughs> excuse me before we go to um, Giza. Now the threat appears to be coming from here so it means if we travel to here we'll be able to get from it from there one of the thing about this is is that if you do wait until you download the entire um dlcs and that um then you will and you decide to level it up to 45 like i did in this instance um you will be able to get the high level side quest and it also means that you can um if you want to um do some of those higher level level quests <coughs> now I'm going to go down this way because I'm sure these soldiers are not going to be that friendly. Well, it looks like I might have just frit the life out of that guy. Now, I think this is part of a side quest. Thank you, but I think it's you that should take care. Now, I've been doing a little bit of research into Bayek's name, and there seems to be two theories that Bayek means eagle bearer, or something related to actually having an eagle. Um, which makes sense, because he does have an eagle. Um, Although technically, in the times of ancient Egypt, you'd have thought they'd have had a hawk rather than an eagle, um, as they were the more predominantly worshipped of the flying um, birds. Eagles, eagles, and hawks are, although descend thousands of years from the dinosaurs from the same particular osset, they are not really closely related in the modern age huh. I love the fact that the hyena just runs away as so I'm walking past it or running past it at some point I will also um, look to um, find um, the tomb of um, Baik himself in the ancient days oh there's a line there I 
go out the hands of my meteorite sword. Anything else I can loot while I'm at it? <laughs> oh, uh, do you know this is one of the things I love about this game is the way the you know normally those animals don't dash out the way they just get run over by the horse um, and virtually killed. Where you know if I had the camel, it wouldn't be too bad. So they barely injure it. <laughs> oh, right. Okay. So this is actually a fault. I mean, they say that it's a threat, but to be fair, they're not actually really... ...a threat as such, because they're just actually at a... ...a fault, um, so... I don't actually remember doing this in the actual um Okay, well I'm trying to find It's an exploration area, but... Okay, we let it cost you your life. Snoker keeps saying, hey, hold on, and then you... Come on, you want to die? <laughs> now let's get out of conflict for something. Oh, okay, so I've got to go back to the commander. Okay, uh, well technically I can steal what's it. I mean look at them looking, trying to find me, look. Oh, they don't even know I'm here. Oh, 
Oh, come on then. You know what? You suffer for it. I'm guessing there's a um, sandstorm on the way. Right, so there's two more things I need to do in here, so what is it? One is this way. Okay, it's just telling me where the invaders are. Oh, there's a little room down here. Let's go down here. Oh. They're already dead soldiers. <laughs> One of the ones that I've killed already. You volunteered to die, so you can die. I will destroy these cards, and Jibade will soon meet Anubis. Oh, so now I've got to destroy some cards, okay. Alright, let me stand here for the minute. I'm actually surprised to be honest that they didn't actually call for aid. I think there is a treasure at the top there, so, um, because that's one of the things I'm looking for. So if I actually go up there, I can probably see these cots. I heard a lion. Has it come into the encampment or is it trapped? Oh, it's a trapped one. To be honest with you, I should actually try to tame a lion. Um, it's one of the things I did say I would try and do in a previous episode. Alright, so I've got to go to other locations to destroy these carts. Oh, apparently it's full. No, okay, so um, I'm going up. Because I no, I said go up. Not, oh, I'm going to jump off. That's your punishment. You can go up by the flipping beaten wall now. Right, so that's the encampment done. So where are these actual... Um, Alright, so one's in the isolate, or two looks like they're in the isolated desert. One is up here um, in New Alexandria. And one is down here. Okay, so it looks like we need to do some assassinations along the way. Um, or assassinate somebody along the way so why don't we do it so if we go back to um, Siba <coughs> I don't know why it won't let me assassinate um, some bizarre reason I don't know whether it's because I got that sword or what. 
Oh, pardon me. Sorry. I have a cup of tea, and it seems to be um, doing opposite of what should happen when you're drinking tea, but. Okay, so. Back at Hetzfus's house. Right, so. I love the fact that he's still got blood on his head. Okay, so the nearest ones were over here. So if we go to let's mark that one. Thank a moon ray. Bayek has returned to the oasis. I love the fact that they're pleased that I'm back, but then you don't really hear very much of them. We could have technically actually done the one in Alexandria first, gonna be honest, um, but I thought as we was near Siwa. Listen, if you want to die, I'm more than happy to oblige, but I would rather you live for today. I've got far more important things to do right now than worry about um, you threatening me. Right, so as I get out of the actual area, the horse will start galloping a bit quicker. One of the things I actually do like about um, this game... Um, actually it's the actual stealthing around faults um you know if you're somebody that's like me that doesn't really have a lot of patience for anything um it is a good way to help get get patience um yeah, so i've kind of grown older I've, i have started to get a bit patient more patient but um sometimes with games it is more difficult but this is really good for that um, <clears throat> one of the things actually you'll find about this game um, as well actually is um, in some aspects is the weirdness of it um, in the fact that you know if you go if you walk around for long enough you'll see so many mirages different things like uh scarab rainfall um and we in the uk those of us that was it know what's it we have this um saying it's raining cats and dogs you know when i posted the um the actual uh screenshot when I got the trophy for the actual scab raining and that is, I just couldn't not help myself in saying oh it's, look, it brings a whole new meaning to raining cats and dogs it's raining scarabs right I, I hope that we are going towards the location that I've actually marked let's just stop follow the road right so hopefully if we're going to end up going to the one in Alexandria, then I'll just fast travel it. One 
one of the things that you know um what's it because um, last night i didn't explain that um we'd actually traveled to dashur which i didn't actually realize um at the time was actually outside of memphis um but it's now um outside not far from modern what's now modern day cairo um I don't know whether it's because I'm following the road, but it seems to be like they're either getting longer or... Oh look! Some flying stars of some sort. Never seen this before. Never seen that before. If you can see those things just flying across the screen. I don't know if it's part of some hallucination that he's having or what, but um... But yeah, if you do the hallucinations in the, um, oh, now there is an actual, looks like there is an actual rock thing coming, yes, there is. Um, let's just go to that, first of all, because, um, last night i said in the episode in order to get the special outfit from the sphinx um, you need to go to all the locations of the of the rocks and place the um stars which is what is called um side quest is called kemu's promise um, there is also a tomb there we could probably do actually um, right, so I'm guessing it's up there. Can I get up there with the horse? Whoa. Okay, so it's up there, so I need to do clamber up there, so... Actually, you know, I, I know I said that I would go to Giza today, but, uh, you know... And if I have enough time I will do so um, um, if nothing else to just get there um, to start the next episode but um, the threat to Siwa um, has actually turned into something of a uh, search for um, assassination so we might as well do it right okay so this is where the oh there we go so you wouldn't think I've done this before, this game, because clearly there's some of this I don't even remember doing. Um, I don't. I mean, I certainly don't remember going to this location. But you know, now I have found that when you do this, if you're not a hundred percent sure where they go, hey, have you talked to this girl you like? I didn't say I liked her. We were friends, but she's being strange and avoiding me. Maybe because she likes you too. We often do not say what we mean. It will come to you in bursts. Why would she avoid me if she likes me? Same reason you're avoiding her. Yeah, so... Say something your mother should explain. I am better with the stars. The goldfish. Called Capricornus by the Greeks. Capricornus. The, the head of a ram and the body of a fish. You see? Even the gods do not always make sense. Ironically, we still refer to it as um, Capricorn today. Not Capricornus, but we do still refer to it as Capricorn. Right, now you see that little streak there, that's giving you an indication where it might be. Um, so. There we go. 
So yeah, if you get that little streak like you got just then, that's an indication of where it should be placed. So follow it in the direction it went, and as you saw just then, I was able to find it. Um, Right, okay, so where are we on terms of the, what's it now? We're in the isolated desert, so we're not far from two locations. There is an actual fast travel point there. Do you know what? Let's go to that, because it is not far from the two locations we need to go to. And we may as well just do at the same time. Now, is there actually anything here of value to... Might as well get you s included in this center. Other than the rock things, no. It doesn't appear so. So let us go. As I say, it seemed like a long way up when I went up there earlier on, but maybe it's because I went down via this way. Come on. If I say go down, that means you go down by it. It doesn't mean you hang there. Right now. No, why are you doing that now? Where's the main road? Clearly didn't go up the same way, come down the same way we went up, so. I remember, actually I do remember this, because the last time I came, I played this, I got attacked along this road. I can't remember if it was by um, hyenas or bandits. Well, if the sandstorm's coming, you're more likely to be protected between rocks than you are. Right, so there is a tomb here as well. Actually, sh shall we do this tomb as well while we're here? Uh, let's go to the map. Let's see, where's the exact location? Because it is literally here. We might as well find the tablet and get the bonus point for it. Or the bonus now when you go on to this you will find that um, you will not have any locations as to where the tombs are um, now we should be alright in this one because it is uh, um, Now, I can't remember if this is... I think it's a hidden doorway, I think. This one. Lots of linen in there. Right now, how to? I don't remember. How is it I found this tablet the last time? I can't remember if there's a secret entrance here or what. They're praying, so I won't disturb them, even though one of them jumped. Okay, so what am I missing here? Come on. All 
Right, let me just take the quest off for these incoming threat for a minute. Oh, no, I didn't need to do that. Map. So this is what annoys me, is when it takes the marker off. Well, it's the actual tablet outside. Come on, Sanu, do your job. Clearly, you have a far better vision than I do. Oh, well, according to this, there is some treasure there, so there must be a way to get round. Oh, so there's so much treasure in here, so there's got to be... more to this than just what I'm seeing. So there's another level somewhere. Oh, okay, so it's just said to me about secret locations, so somewhere here there should be a load of scarabs going into a, a wall. Let's go up this way because this was actually going. Oh, hang on, there we go, there's the, uh, ah. Oh. Oh, I think I remember now what this one is. I think this is an underwater one. I can assure you there probably won't be a snake living in that. There you go, there it is. Ancient writing from the old kingdom. Now, I have to admit, you know, that when I first um since I've played this I've actually been watching some other YouTubers um, play it and um, you know just to see you know how they do it because it's they do it differently um, now the fact that this is open shows you that at some point I've obviously already been here um, don't know if that passes over from the previous game that I played, I've got no idea, but... Hello! Not that I would actually probably say it now, but well, so there's my horse. Doing his usual trick of running off. Right, so we're going to go to this fast point, and then to those two locations, destroy the carts. So the trouble is, is that when I'm doing this, is time is goes so quick, and um, so far I don't feel 
look like I've really achieved very much for you but uh, you know I'll save that and then you know I thought about it last night because I said the same thing do you really want to see me tomb raiding do you really want to see me going into the pyramids and raiding the tombs reading the ancient tablets stealing the silicon I'm thinking well actually they probably do because you know yes there are admittedly um on YouTube some places where you can um actually look up how to go to, through certain pyramids or tombs when you're raiding them but you know if you start following somebody who's actually done um, um, who's actually doing the game now I think you are actually taking me away from the let's get Senny to go up Ooh, quite a big fault. So you know what I was saying about going through faults. Now, according to this, the viewpoint is up here as well, somewhere. So, yeah, it's there. So, I've got a feeling... Oh! Did I just kill a goat? Yeah, I did. Come on, Lucius, don't be funny now. Always sad to leave you up for the hyenas to eat, but I know for a fact that even if they do, you'll still be alive. Due to the miracles of um, the horse god. Go on. Up you go, Bayek. So actually, you know, when you think about it, this, it didn't turn out to be so bad after all, because we've got to go to a f quite a fairly large fort. Um, and of course, if Bayek actually hurries up and goes up like I'm requesting him to, then... Mind you, I say that, it doesn't help myself, because I've been playing um, on my Nintendo Switch um, New Horizons and um, so um, and the controls are slightly different on that um, so I have to remember that um, when I'm doing this I just hear a little growl or something oh well if I did it didn't come to attack me so Well, there's something you wanted to then. What was it? If you want a piece of me, come and get me. Yeah, I thought you'd run off. Oh look, we're actually not far from a lake. Which would make sense as to why the fault is there as well. So, what about is this fault now? So, I think that is one of the actual locations I need to go to for this quest, so...
Yes, but it appears to be on the outside and on the So, um, it's actually a haystack to jump into here. Normally, there is. Oh, apparently not. And that really hurt him as well. Sorry, Bayek. I thought there was a pile of hay there on there somewhere. Right now it's worth looking in this sometimes because you might actually find some treasure that um, somebody's... oh there it is, look. Might actually find some treasure here that whoever was in here has um, left behind. In this instance they have. Clearly you're dead. So you weren't a great lookout, were you, mate? Anyway, let's get to this fault. What you were obviously killed by whatever was in there. Now, something tells me that these are going to be either on the inside or on the outside. Oh, look. Thank you. Appreciate the lever. Oh, so you assume that he's actually already in there. Okay. Oh, yes, I remember this one. The last time I did this, I remember um, going in and literally just annihilating a lot of them, which I did at a later date, to be honest. Now, for me, the key question is, do they have something to alert? anybody I'm pretty sure they did and I'm uh, so there's one of the carts I think that's the guy that I've got to assassinate there. Oh, that's what I'm looking for there. Now, I should be cautious around here. Die, idiot. Hey, now. Ok, 
go, you're going to be somebody's meal now. Uh, instead of hanging there, why do you... Oh, come and get... Don't go on the... Just let me get my hands on you. Well, you clearly know I'm here, but yeah, you can't find me. Right, where's your thing again? Really? Some fast bastard just comes up and just whacks me and that's it, I'm dead? Wow, just wow. <sighs> Didn't even let me confirm the kill. Yeah, and I just killed him with the bloody swords again to... Excuse me. So I want the Ultra Blade on there. And I want that one there. I said to you, assassinate. What do you do? You just stop. So I'm pressing the wrong flipping button. Instead of pressing the triangle button, I'm pressing the wrong. 
You know what? It's poisoned them. Worked for me the last time. Right, I want to assassinate that guy at least before I end this. What? You should not have come here. What is this? Well, I might as well avenge Crest while I'm here, so... There's probably two that the others can say. What's the bet it sees ones out here? Right, so it's always good to avenge him. Um, so, right, let's let's kill this bloke because the time's almost coming up. So, hey, no. you are dead. Hey, no. work with me. Right, where's your flipping what's it thing? I need to stop you from The fort commander is still unwilling to join us. Soon more soldiers will arrive. We'll outnumber him four to one. Enough to give him. We'll try to take out his forces. We'll impose a siege. Stop them. Excellent idea. Hey, hold on. No space. Keep tight. What time has come? This way, brother. Can we? Fucking sorted you out. There you are. Can we actually focus on them? Right, cool. 
confirm kill before anybody comes in. Now to destroy the guns. <sighs> well, I won't know where one of the carts is. I think I've just found the... Here we go. Set trap. So now if they call for aid, it's tough luck on their part. Right, so this is going to be coming to an end soon. Where is he? Worms take you. So, oh, <laughs> Don't think I'm going to get um, Bye Uh, yes, so my hour is literally coming up for this. Um, it's taken much longer than I thought. Um, so it looks like the next episode we will not even be getting <laughs> um, to Sacred Giza. Right, so I've only got one more treasure to find. Um, so I'm going to say goodbye for now. And um, thank you very much for watching. So if you like what you saw, hit the like and subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next episode. Mod Nightly, still in this place. Bye for now.